You can f with me if you wanted to. These expensive. These hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Brandon Nicole, and today I am going to do an update for you guys because I've been saying that I was going to do this update like months ago and I just never got around to it. So today I'm going to be doing an update for the Virgin Hair Fertilizer. This is one of the most popular videos on my channel is the five days got results in five days video with this virgin hair fertilizer and i told you guys i'm gonna keep you guys updated i think somebody wanted me to do an update in the comments this natural lighting is like making my face look flushed out and weird but just bear with me so honestly i didn't do the video because i did not get around to it i didn't stop using it i continued to use it um lately with the transition to school and like just getting into school and stuff like that i've been super lazy with my hair i am not gonna even lie guys like i've been super lazy and just doing my night routine i think i did a night routine yeah i did a night routine for my hair um if i didn't i think i did whatever i did do a video on my nighttime routine on my hair on instagram so if you're interested in checking that out i'll definitely leave my instagram link down below because it always is y'all but I did do a video showing you guys that I use this every single night and then I use my Jamaican black castor oil, you know, and that's what I did. I, I use the virgin hair fertilizer every single night and even though it's literally greased, like one of the main ingredients is petroleum jelly, like that's Vaseline. So even though it is super greasy, it didn't really do anything to my hair like every night, like putting it in my hair, it didn't make it super greasy or like weighed down or just nasty, you know, so I use that, I continue to use it every night. But like I said, I've been super lazy with my hair because I've been in school and I just haven't felt like doing much to my hair. And I don't know, but I've been using it like maybe not every day, but definitely at least like three to four times a week. And I think a week ago, about a week ago, I don't know. I have my hair in a protective style. I had it in a bun, except it was like a low like military bun. And I would wrap my hair every night to make sure, you know, my edges was laid and like, you know, I was ready to go for the next day. So I didn't have to do my hair. And I really liked doing that, obviously, because I didn't have to do my hair. But because it was just easier to maintain that week, like I said, I've been lazy, so I didn't need to do anything to my hair. But even though my hair was still in a protective style, I still applied my virgin hair fertilizer. And I just applied it where I could easily apply it. So like just my like edges and like the front part of my hair and like the back. That's all I did. I didn't touch like the actual bun itself. I just put it where I could without messing anything up. And the same with the Jamaican black castor oil. I only put that on my edges and my ends anyway so it was good to go. But I've been using this stuff like crazy. This is my third tube. Um, I've learned to really like not load it on my hands like I'm obsessed with it because it has peppermint oil in it and you can like feel the peppermint like tingling on your scalp so like I used to just put like a shit ton in my hair just because I liked like that feeling of the peppermint just like tingling my scalp <laughs> but I learned to like be really cautious with it because you know like I said I'm a college student almost every video I am not trying to keep running like on eBay trying to buy this stuff so this is my third tube like I said I still have a lot of products left um it's beat up as you can see the box is beat up but I still really really like using this stuff now in my last video I said that I experienced more of like um thickness which is still making my hair you know like thick it's keeping it nice and thick my hair is naturally very very fine when I straighten my hair I mean you may not be able to tell my hair is curly because everybody thinks curly hair is thick I don't know why it just looks that way because it looks like you I don't know auditioning for the Lion King so everyone assumes that it's thick but my curly hair is not you can like see through my curls when I wear it down and that's like a sign of you know you have fine hair um and it's not necessarily like a, a bad thing that I have fine hair. It's just something like what I was born with. You know, people have fine hair, people have thick hair. It doesn't mean that my hair is un, like unhealthy or, you know, is in bad shape. Just that's how my hair is. But I do want, you know, like thicker hair. So like when I straighten my hair, like before I started doing any of this stuff, like taking care of it, my hair was so fine, y'all. When I straightened my hair, it could barely sit in a ponytail. No matter how many times I wrap that little ponytail around, the little thing, it would just slowly slide down the back of my ponytail. It was just a tragic story. So this stuff um, has really thickened my hair. And like I know it's a grease, so you guys are probably just like, it's just the grease reacted. No, it's not just the grease because when I wash my hair 
and I'm washing like all the crap out of my hair that I put in during the week I can still tell that my hair is thicker than it was before I started using this stuff so this will forever stay in my regimen I do not care I will always find a way so this virgin hair fertilizer is bomb it is definitely now starting to grow my hair because I've been using it for months now so it's definitely starting to grow my hair now and I'm really starting to love the results I'm getting because I'm starting to really really see results in my hair um I don't know if I have any like current pictures of anything I'll see if I can insert stuff if I do I'll try to insert it if not it's because I don't know how but I'm gonna figure it out for y'all I'm gonna figure it out for y'all so as far as this stuff you can get it on eBay Amazon um I know people have said that you can find it in your local beauty supply I have not found it in my local beauty supply um People said that they found it in like their local like I don't know like you know like beauty supply like in the city. Um I live out in the suburbs and like <laughs> this is a lost cause I think. They do have it um 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 what what am I doing? They do have it at Walmart, not at Walmart on the site. So if you go like to Walmart.com and you type in virgin hair fertilizer, they'll have it. It's sold by like a different distributor, not actually Walmart itself, but it's still there. It retails for seven dollars, I think, but you can get it cheaper. You can get two for like nine dollars on eBay, which I think I'll link the exact link for you guys down below so you guys don't have to search and everything. So as far as my update, it is definitely growing my hair, it's definitely keeping my hair nice and thick and moisturized so there's a lot of benefits to this product and it's super cheap and like i said um in my last video this is the virgin hair fertilizer there is another one the american brand called virgo they that um they are the exact same thing they have the exact same things in them just that's the american name for it like i said this was like a nigerian thing and you want to make sure that when you get this it has the red cap if it doesn't have the red cap and it's yellow it is a fake one so make sure that when you get this it is the red cap and if you happen to get something with the yellow cap throw it out toss it away send it back it's fake just get the one with the red cap so if you enjoy my updates definitely give this video a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe to my channel turn on your notification bell so you're notified as soon as i upload a video and i will see you guys in my next one